Hey, what's happening, gamers? Welcome back to Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney Trilogy for the Nintendo Switch. Yeah! And it's time to resume Justice for All with a brand spanking new episode. Now, the moment you've all been waiting for. Uh -huh. Who will be this year's Grand Prix Champion? Who will be the Hero of Heroes? Ooh. Yeah. Wait, Will it be last year's runner-up, Jammin' Ninja, or Captain Siapan? I don't know. I see students of a certain starry school, a global hero. All these weird Japanese oh, yeah. names I can't say. Somebody. We hope Lady Luck is with you all today, heroes. The winner of the third annual Hero of Hero Awards is... Me! Huh? Me? Wait, somebody just destroyed the moon? What? <gasps> the true hero of the night has appeared in our midst! Ooh, I don't know what they said. It looks like this year's Grand Prix goes to this fantastic warrior! The Silver Samurai! The Nickel Samurai! What? Too bad, Jam and Ninja. Looks like the title eluded you again this year. What? I have no idea what just happened. March 20th, 7.42 p.m., Gatewater Hotel. I don't know, voila, huh? All oh, right, yes! Did you hear that, Nick? Did you? The Nick of Samurai, he did it! Yeah, he sure did. I'm getting way too old for this. I am so proud of the guy for doing the series justice. Yay, Mr. Powers. Uh, um, so the person everyone was cheering for? Yep, he did, Pearls. You know who we're talking about, right? Pearly, the Nickel Samurai! No! Every Sunday I only watch the educational channels, kids! Masterpiece Theater! Oh, okay. Well, that's it. From now on, it's gonna be the Steel Samurai! All the kids watch it, Pearls! Nickel. Oh, the Nickel one. Uh, do you like the Nickel Samurai too, Mr. Nick? Nah, Nick's an old person, so he's not allowed to watch it anymore, haha. <laughs> Are you kidding me? You have an issue? I don't like saying that word. Wow. <laughs> That's right, but I do kind of like Kids Masterpiece Theater. That word bothers me. Hey, I didn't know that you were so young at heart, Nick. Mr. Nick, you're a grown-up. You're not allowed to watch it anymore. You're supposed to act your age and have interest in magic! That's very important. Aww, give it a rest, Pearly. Ah, looks like I made the right choice in inviting everyone here. Ha 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 I'm glad you're all having a good time. Ah, it's like a dream. Too bad for the Jam and Ninja, though. Aww. Last year he lost to the Pink Princess Warrior of Little Old Tokyo. Hmm. I thought this might be his year. Yeah. Oh, hey. Did anyone else think that the Jammer and Ninja looked a little bit different today? Different? What do you mean? Um, well, he was carrying his bright red guitar. Wasn't. I mean, he wasn't. Hey, you're right. Strange he'd walk around without his signature guitar. Oh, yeah, that's what I meant. Uh, I'll never understand these people in their guest shows. Anyway, uh, Mr. Powers, uh, thank you very much for tonight. Oh, it was nothing, guys. I owe you one, so it's just my way of saying thanks. Hey, Nick! Come on! It's time to get going to the lobby! There's a post-ceremony stage show that's supposed to start really soon! And then I heard there's going to be a press conference after that! A press conference? Is this going to make a speech about winning the uh, prize this year? Oh, the winner? Oh, uh, well, not exactly. Something about Nickel Samurai confessing something, I don't know. Huh? Confessing? Sounds pretty serious. Ah, Nick, come on! You don't want us to be the last ones there, do you? Come on, Mr. Nick, do you? Why me? The show doesn't even start for another 20 minutes. Yeah, just commercials. Oh, we can talk to Will. Thank you very much for inviting us today. 
Aw, oh, it was nothing really. Guys like us don't get to come to a place like this often, so I thought I'd invite you all. Hey, Mr. Powers! What have you been up to lately? Well, uh, since the Pink Princess successfully wrapped last month, I've been on Kids Exercise Show. <laughs> huh? While wearing a rabbit mask over my face. Oh, I see! <laughs> I'm still really sorry about all the headache I caused that time, Mr. Wright. Ah, well, what's done is done, so let's forget about it. This is Will Powers, he's an action star. His popularity exploded when he was a steel samurai. Yay. And he was the first case Maya worked on with me. It's too bad you look scary, or people would know you're a real softie with what is good with kids. He doesn't um, look scary. Um, thanks? He doesn't look scary. <laughs> I can't believe they're gonna make a movie based on the Nickel Samurai. I can't believe it either, Nick! But for a different reason! Uh... The Steel Samurai, an epic story of one hero in a desperate fight against his arch ne nemesis, the evil magistrate in the city of Neo Old Tokyo. Hmm. And then you have. And last year they started a new series, The Nickel Samurai. The new series seems to be a hit with the kids, too. I'm really attached to the Steel Samurai as a show, so I was hoping that maybe I'd get a chance to do something in this new one. Yeah, it's too bad. It has been awesome to see you with the new actor, Matt Ungard. He's super popular right now. Mr. Ungard? Looks like Pearls doesn't know who that is. It's gonna be the Nickel Samurai versus the Jam and Ninja at the box office. Jam and Ninja? Who's that again? The Jam and Ninja. So who's this Jam and Ninja again? He's a hero, Donic. His symbol is a bright red guitar that he's always carrying. A ninja who's always carrying around a bright red guitar. How does that even work? It's his ninja guitar, of course. Whoa. With a scarf around his neck and a guitar in his hand, he rises to stardom in an ancient time. A ninja who becomes a star? Yeah, a ninja who becomes a star! It's awesome! There's a strong rivalry between the two of them. Global Studios Nickel Samurai and Worldwide Studios Jammin' Ninja. They even air at the same time. Well... You know what I heard? I heard those two don't get along at all! Uh, would you? Probably not. The Nickel Samurai's on guard! And the guy who plays the Jam Ninja, I mean... The Nickel Samurai speaks French? Oh, you mean Matt on guard, the actor. Uh, I get it. Uh -huh. I guess even the world of heroes isn't a sparkling happy place, huh? Yeah. The world of actors. The world like of actors. It. Uh, Attorney let's... badge! I don't know. What is this? Nickel Samurai. Do you have anything more to tell us about this, uh... Sorry. Thanks for t uh, taking the time to take it out and show me, though. But I'm really sorry. I, I don't know a thing about it. Alright, what about this? Ah! I really owe you one! If it weren't for you guys, I don't know what would have happened. Hmm. What would you do? It was a real tight spot I was in, and, well, you know, you guys fought so hard to get me out. Actually, it was Cody that fought hard. Huh? Oh, I thought he stood up for the Steel Samurai. Cody or Corey? I forgot the kid's name. kid's name. I don't care what happens. I'll never forget anything you've done for me, guys. Okay. All right, so we talked to you um, on right. everything. The next thing we do is we examine. That's right. What can I say? This is a really high-class hotel, Nick! I've never eaten this kind of salad before! Poor Pearls, having eaten only vegetables all her life, she's been missing out. Salad! Don't worry, any leftovers belong in my happily awaiting stomach, anyway. You're a glutton, Maya. <laughs> I lose this one to Maya. You sure can eat. Maya's hungry. Well, a growing girl needs her nutrients! You're almost 19. I think you should maybe... Okay. A growing girl, <laughs> exactly how big do you plan on getting? I Whale size? A... I want to be a giant, Nick! Be a giant. And stop 
fun villages! This sure is one luxurious hotel. Almost to the point of gaudy with how it blends together with fancy unimaginable. Speaking of fancy, didn't that bellboy give me something like that last year? Mm. Maybe oh he gosh. did. What else can we examine? Anything else? Okay, More food. Go. If this is all a dream, I don't ever want to wake up! And all the directors and stars that were here to see the heroes, wow! I had no idea who most of them were, though. Neither did I! Nick, you've got to cut that news only. Have it out. Your new show is going to be the Nickel Samurai every Sunday morning at 8 a.m. Oh, I know. We can watch it together starting next week. I'll come wake you up extra early in the morning to make sure, okay? Can I just DVR it? <laughs> Uh, I'm fine, you know. I really don't have uh, it on my account. And 6 a.m. it is! No! The award ceremony was just held on that stage. It was really fabulous. You just reminded me of the circus for a second. Oh, sorry. Wow. <laughs> wow! Shows like that are guaranteed to be good, you know? Okay, so he said, yeah, he did say the max line. Anything else we can examine here? There was a thing over there, the door. Oh, that was the door. That chandelier is really something, isn't it? I thought it was kind of like a spaceship. Hey, Nick, how about we get one of those for the office? One of those hanging from our poor, weak ceiling? I don't think so. Aw, you're no fun, Nick. Nick's plenty fun. Nick is the... Fun. He's right. the king of fun. There's a grand set of doors over there. Ah, oh, behind those doors is an equally grand lobby. Shall we go and take a look, Mr. Nick? Hey, wait up! This grand dessert is calling to me! It's saying, eat me now! All right. Um, so we've pretty much done everything we can here. Let's move on to the hallway. I love the Steel Samurai theme song. March 20th, Gatewater Hotel Hallway. I'm gonna get that ringtone. Wow, what is this place? Looks like I've stumbled into Oz or something. Mm -hmm. Way in the back, there's a sign for the bathroom. Maybe I should vi visit it while I can before the show starts. Mm. Are you really going to the bathroom? Visit the little lawyer's room. Oh, there's a teddy bear here. Oh. I can understand flowers in the front of the dressing rooms, but what are stuffed bears doing here? Could it be that there's an action star with a soft spot for teddy bears? Nah, can't be. I like teddy bears. Compared to the flowers on the other side of the hall, uh, these are much more gorgeous. That's because you are a teddy bear. Let's see, record companies, fan clubs, company workers, family? Carrying all these flowers home would be hard, I think. You would think so. Well, somebody's really famous is in that dressing room, I feel like. There's a piece of paper taped to the door. It says, Juan Cord... Corita's room? Juan Corita, thank you. Juan Corita? His name sounds just like a star's name. I've heard it before, but I don't know anything about him at all. So this guy's got way more flowers than this person. Yep. There's a piece of paper taped to the door, and it says, Matt on guard's room. Matt on guard? I've heard that name before. Oh, yeah! Maya's always mummering about him. Uh, something about the star show. Yeah, she's a show. an obsessed fan with him. Yeah. To Mr. On guard from Global Studio staff. Ah, it'd be nice if lawyers got flowers, too. Something like, to Mr. Wright from all of your grateful clients. Yeah! Who have no money. <laughs> I know! Uh, this is... I guess we'll go down towards the bathroom. There are toilets in each room in this hotel. Yay. But since all sorts of events are held here, there are bathrooms for people who aren't staying here to use as well. Perfect for people like me who can't afford to stay here in the first place. <laughs> okay. Uh, we just came this from the hall. This looks like a super fancy hotel. It does. Oh my gosh, remember when we were first married and there was that hotel? In Massachusetts, and we went in there, and it had a ballroom. And you and I went in there just to use the bathroom really quick, and everyone yep. stared at us. Yep. This is reminding me so much of that right now. That was really weird. Um, let's go back. What what yeah. other things can we do here? 
Move around. I've never Guess, been in a hotel go back to the hall. had a bowl. Sounds like the post-ceremony show is about to start. Except for that one. <laughs> All right, I'm so pumped. I wonder if he's going to show off his special move today. Nickel Samurai Smelting. Say what now? Actually, what I'm interested in most is the press conference. You mean the big confession the Nickel Samurai is going to make after the show? So what is it? Don't you think? What's it about, Mr. Powers? Uh, well, I'm not the Steel Samurai anymore, so I have no idea. Bah! Bah, sorry. Oh, I guess you're all going to the press conference then, right? Yeah, of course! If that's the case, then here, take these tickets so you can get in. <laughs> oh, we didn't have tickets! Press conference added to the court record. Gee, thanks! Thank you so much. Well, let's get going to the lobby. Again! It looks like it's over this way, Mr. Nick! Somebody hear a mouse? Okay! For great justice! All right, I forgot how to do Pearl's voice. Uh, Pearl's is really tiny. Hotel lobby. Wow. March 20th, Gatewater Hotel lobby. Hmm, only a really gaudy hotel would have such a large gaudy lobby to match. Mm. Uh, I think they're going to have the post ceremony show over there. They're using a compact stage, I see. Oh, I'm ready to use my special samurai power, Nick. Maya looks like she's ready to start a fight. Yes! Your attention, please. Your attention, please. The Nickel Samurai's post-ceremony stage show will not be held tonight due to unforeseen circumstances. What? Why? Ow! You didn't have to punch me. Pinch yourself if you don't believe it. Yow! We are asking for everyone's cooperation at this time. So please stay where you are. This is a special request from the police. Huh? Oh, oh no! P police Did they just say police? Do you want me to go check out what's going on? Uh, wait, I'll come with you. Freeze! <gasps> you two! Didn't you hear the announcement just now? I just finished telling you not to move. Th that voice! I've heard that voice someone before! It's a gumshoe? Uh... No idea who this is. Oh my gosh, is it the lady? I don't know. Honestly, youth these days can't be bothered to listen to other people when they talk! Wait, that's the lady? Just the other day, it was oh my there and bridge out! And then comes the bridge! I tried to tell the boy in the bridge! They said, listen, of course that! And the bridge in the out part is what the dangerous! I am that really meant well! I'll let him have it! Off the bridge! Honestly, kids these days! This non-stop chatter! It can't be Miss Old Bag! No! No! Why is she back? What is it? You snappers! Do I know you? Wait! You! You're powers, aren't you? Uh, yeah, um, about what happened back then. You didn't even get nominated this year, did you? Oh, that's right. You're doing that children's exercise program. Trying to play nice. Uh, yeah, that, that's me. Thankfully, I still have a job. I love that show, and you're a hoot! You're the big brother character. Yes, even with your face. What a work of art. But how is it, you know? You know, the TVs, you break? Really? They're getting what they deserve. This is why I told you. Um, <laughs> what are you doing here? Look at my uniform and tell me that you can't tell that I'm a member of security. What the outfit? Annoying, nosy brat. Get the blaster. Run a ta 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 Bing! 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 Uh, I'm so confused. Uh, Wendy Old Bag, uh, what are you doing here? What happened to your position at Global Studios? Oh, that place. Well, since that incident, they've been letting people go, you know? When they cut the security team, I got the pink slip. Hm. Whoops. What incident? What did you do? I didn't do anything, you youngin'! 
Don't you remember? That incident a year ago! When this lady got on the witness stand and testified! Yeah, I remember. And you! Weren't you the one who was bullying me, this fragile girl at heart? Um, I plead the fifth! But you know, I think maybe I rubbed the upper management the wrong way by testifying. <laughs> yes, that has to be it! Everything is all your fault! Me? I thought about being a bodyguard at first, after being hand-picked, handed old Pinky. You a bodyguard? Uh, oh, your friend, that fiery good-looking guy with the red jacket and the ruffles. Oh, Mr. Edgeworth? But? That sort of arrangement would be entirely too troublesome for me. That's what he said to me. Can you believe it? What did I ever do to deserve that? Red is head, 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 head. Okay. Um, so, did something happen? I don't have all the details, Missy, but it looks like another one of those incidents happened again. Uh, an incident? Like a murder kind of incident? Maybe. You see, I'm a bit of a devilish woman. So wherever I go, showers of blood are sure to follow. But you don't know that. Didn't. I mean, I bet you didn't know that. Um, then shouldn't you quit being a security guard, at least for people's sake? Silence, you whippersnapper! Run a tip 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 Uh, hey, Nick! Hmm? What's up? I don't like that devilish smile playing on your lips. Let's make it like we're going to the bathroom, and then we'll check things out! No way! The police told us not to go anywhere, remember? Huh? How boring of you, Nick! You're such a boring guy! No motivation, no spirit! Huh? What's going on? Are giving Mystic Maya trouble again, Mr. Nick? Not you too, Pearls. Please don't stick your little nose into this one. So listen to this, Pearly. This one time at lawyer camp, Nick... Okay, I get it. Let's go take a look. <laughs> Yay! I knew you couldn't say no to me, Nick. That's right. You walk over in miles of hot coals for Mystic Maya, wouldn't you, Mr. Nick? Oh. That would be every time we work a case together. <laughs> well, what are you waiting for? Let's go. All right. Early wants to come. Bye bye. Okay, Gatewater Hotel, the hall. There's nothing really out of the ordinary here. Oh, are you looking for the incident about the old lady was talking about? Doesn't look like it happened here. Well, we'd better go look somewhere else then. All right then, let's try. Excuse me. Are you by chance, Miss Maya Fay? Um, yeah, that's me. Oh, you have a phone call waiting for you at the front desk. A call? I wonder if it's somebody from the crime village. Oh, what's wrong, Miss Maya? Oh, nothing, Pearls. You go, guys, go ahead, and I'll be right there, okay? Okay. All right, this way, Miss Fay. Let's go look somewhere else, though, Mr. Nick. Yeah, okay. This is a little exciting and a little scary, too. You're gonna have a child go investigate a murder scene. Why are, why are you letting her go with that shady person? I didn't mean to, like, I don't know, it just, it just looks like... March okay. 20th, Gatewater Hotel, Hallway. I told you! Get people the info they want, that means that you've got a uh, right to know. Nope, don't care who you are, pal. We're still investigating, so you can't go in. What's your problem? Now, uh, just wait. It'll be over in the morning. Scruffy detective, secret scandal revealed. You'll see. I'll get you back. Those two sound pretty serious. That southern accent can only mean... Hey, right. Oh, no. Oh, no, it's Lada. Have fun, Amber. No. 
Come on, do a gal a favor, till this cup. I'm just doing my job and I got rights, you know? So a lot of heart, Wendy old bag. Oh, this is too good. No! Oh, you! Oh, Detective Gumshoe, what's up? Hey, pal, help a guy out. Tell her that only the police are allowed here. Oh, this is the scene of a murder, so she should leave this to the... Oh, shoot! Me and my big mouth. See? I knew it! My gut instinct told me so! I always trust my gut, a murder it said, and that's what it is! A genuine murder! Oh, boy. Hey, wait a sec! Oh. Uh, I'm, that's her still. Yeah, a murder of a big star, no less! Oh, yeah! Oh, man, I'm in trouble now! Oh. Alright, what's up, Gumshoe? So, detective, uh, a murder? Uh, nope, that's not it. Uh, I've got my facts mixed up for a, a second there, pal. <laughs> uh, um, Mr. Nick, is the dead person the nickel samurai? Huh? Why would you ask? Well, Miss Maya was rooting for him, so... Uh, it wasn't the nickel samurai that got bumped. Uh, actually, the nickel samurai's the one under suspicion for doing the bumping off. What? Uh, that guy that died was the hero named the Jammin' Ninja. Mm. The Jammin' Ninja? Um, oh, that's Pearl. Um, that woman with the big puppy hair, that looks like cotton candy. You mean Lada? Uh, yeah, that woman, she was there that time too, right? That time... Oh, right, that time. Well, Lotta's a journalist, so that's why she was there. Journalist? It, uh, it looks like she was hanging around here before the uh, murder happened, guys. Hanging around? Yeah, hiding in wait for the uh, jamming ninja's door. Um, but why would she? Uh, she wouldn't tell me, pal. Just saying something like, getting my big scoop. Scoop? What sort of news would she be after? The victim. Uh, so the victim was the Jammin' Ninja? Mr. Jammin' Ninja? Uh, he was only a really popular rival TV show to the Nickel Samurai. Oh! Uh, the victim was the action star Juan Kuroda. Rita, I don't know. He got a huge push and rode the express train to stardom. Uh, you mean, I even know who he is. Even I know who he is, okay. Yeah, even I recognize his face. Mmm. Uh, but I heard lately that Matt on guards uh, been taking the wind out of his sail. I'm telling you, pal, as far as who's popular, those two are hogging all the limelight. <laughs> I guess there's no space for Mr. Powers at all. Poor guy. Aww. Mr. on guard? Um, that's the Nickel Samurai, right? Uh, yep, I mean, no! Uh, you got to say it with more umph, the Nickel Samurai! Oh my gosh. Anyways, so now that Juan Kuroda's gone, that means, uh, Mr. On Guard has the whole stage to himself, wouldn't you say? Uh, I wouldn't be, uh, bet on that, pal. We can't have that happen, you know? Can't have what happen? What's that supposed to mean, I wonder? Okay... Well, he's not really gonna tell us anything else. Uh... What is this? Would you take a look at this for me, detective? Uh, listen, pal. I'm not leaking any info about the evidence to you at this time. If I do, my salary's really gonna get hit. <laughs> and then I won't even be able to get those instant noodles down at the discount market. Wow, they're paying him hardly anything. Would you take a look at this, detective? Or gumshoe. Listen, I already said the same thing about the noodles. And then I won't even be able to buy my instant noodles. Okay. Well, let's try this. Are you hiding anything? Would you take a look at this for me? Oh, no. Alright, he has nothing else to tell me. Try our badge! Would you take a look at this for me, detective? Listen, pal. Yeah, he's... okay. Alright, he doesn't want to talk Alright, he doesn't want to talk at all. Um... Do we have any profiles? Yes, we do. Alright, let's talk about him. Uh, the Nickel Samurai! He really took the Grand Prix tonight! Uh, Maya's a big fan of his. Really? Oh, I'm- I'm sorry then. Oh, why are you sorry? 
Uh, Matt on guard was just arrested, pal. On suspicion of murdering Juan Corita. What? Okay. Uh, Jam and Ninja. I'm not a real fan of action shows or anything, but I know who Juan Corita and Matt on guard are. Haha. <laughs> You can't talk about one without talking about the other, I guess. <laughs> uh, they even debuted at around the same time. Uh, so they have this real fiery rivalry with each other. Kinda like you and me, pal! I never knew that you thought of me as a rival? Kinda hurt. I know, right? Do you have anything else to say? Yes, he does. Yeah, rivals were friends! Arrested! Why was, uh, on guard arrested? Sorry, pal, but that's not something I can tell you. Uh, we just started the investigation, so we don't want any leaks. Looks like yet another Steel Samurai hero is hot in water. Mm -hmm. Is in hot water. Um, Mr. Nick, if Ms. Maya knew about this... Yeah, I know. She'd make me take this case. I know. Alright, um... Because she's a fan of the Nickel yeah, Samurai. Yeah, she's a big fan. Good thing she's not around right now. How long is that phone call taking her? No idea. Uh, let's ask about... Do you remember Mr. Powers? Do you know who this person is? Uh, you meet a lot of people as a detective, pal. So, uh, we make extra sure not to forget people because that's our job. <laughs> now, having said that, I don't ever remember seeing this person before. Uh -huh. That's a lie. Which means that you're kind of forgetful, aren't you, Mr. Detective? That's not what it means. Not exactly, anyway. Okay. Um, oh, maybe Wendy Oldbag? Just try him again. Uh, do you know who this person is, Detective? No, he's gonna say the same thing. Bop, 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 bop. Okay. That means we need to leave. So we pretty much exhausted everything that we can do. Yeah. We've clicked on everything. So the only place yeah, that we first. can return to is the hallway. Mm. And the hotel lobby. Okay. There we go. Right trail. Ah, Gatewater Hotel, Hotel Lobby. March 20th. Hey, what's going on, Mr. Wright? Um, looks like uh, Juan Carita has been killed. What? Juan is... he's... It looks like he was murdered and the suspect was arrested. That suspect is Matt on guard. Whoa. You're joking, right? Nope. They were, uh, arrested the Nickel Samurai on suspicion of murdering the Jammin' Ninja. Oh, not again. I feel sick. It's happening again. Again? About a year ago, something just like this happened, Pearls. I still can't believe. No way. No way, Matt would... Huh? Uh, what's Mr. Powers got in his hand? Oh, uh, before I forget, this was, uh, for you, Mr. Wright. I got this from the bellboy that came by earlier with Maya. Mm. Radio transceiver received from Mr. Powers. Whoa. For me? But why? I don't know. All he said was it was for Mr. Phoenix Wright, the attorney. Okay. Okay, it's really creepy, like James Bondy villain <laughs> stuff. Matt and Juan. Uh, Matt is the most energetic and active actor out there right now. Uh, the Nickel Samurai sealed his place as a pop idol, but he kept adding fuel to the fire of his rivalry with Juan. Mr. Juan, he's the German ninja, right? Uh, he was. Those two would butt heads, uh, everything that they could think of on everything. But I'd say that Matt was the one almost always came out on top. Ugh. I guess some people only know how to relate to others by butting heads like a ram. Juan said that he'd take Matt on this time, too, so he joined a rival TV show. And that was the German Ninja! The stylish Nickel Samurai and the burning Jammin' Ninja! Well, things turned messy real fast with those two using their shows for their war. And the final tally, uh, look around, it's pretty obvious how things ended up. Matt even won the Grand Prix this year. The final win over his rival, I guess. Mm. The press conference. Um, Mr. On Guard was gonna hold a press conference, wasn't he? Uh, that's what I heard. Though, if he wanted to get technical about it, it was the Nickel Samurai's conference. The Nickel Samurai's? Yeah, he was supposed to wear his costume and give the press conference that way. 
was going to wear his costume? But why? I'm not sure. They didn't keep me in the loop anymore. I'm on a kid's TV show exercising as a giant rabbit. Yeah. Uh, I was just wondering, where's Miss Maya? It's been quite a long time. Now that she mentions it, Maya was only going to answer a phone call. Maybe she got lost. I'll take a quick look around for her. Wait, pearls? Beep, beep, beep. Ah! You don't have to try that hard, Amber. She's okay. like at least two years older now. Oh, uh, okay. I'm not sure. Uh, maybe this thing? She still looks small. It's coming from this transceiver. Y yes, hello. Uh, Phoenix Wright here. Is this Mr. Phoenix Wright, the attorney? And you are? You don't need to know who I am. I think you have other things to be concerning yourself with. Such as... Help! Nick! M Mystic Maya! Maya? So, Mr. Wright, wouldn't you agree that the more important issue is the fate of the girl? Her fate? Does that mean what I think he means? Maya! Where are you? Are you hurt? Come now. Don't fall apart on me yet. Oh my gosh. This... No! This can't be! Maya! Now that I have your attention, Mr. Attorney, I have a modest proposal for you. If you do what I require, then I will return to you your valuable item, unharmed. Oh my gosh! What is this called again, in your fancy lawyer terms? Kidnapping for ransom? Yes, that's it. This is a kidnapping. <gasps> Those RIP headphones. My sight, everything's fading away. Maya, Maya, Maya's been kidnapped. Are, are you there, Mr. Attorney? Are, are you there? How much? How much do you want? Very good, Mr. Attorney. I'm glad you have such a good grasp of the situation. Hurry up and state your condition and then return my. Money is not what I seek. What? What? What I want is a certain verdict. I would like a complete acquittal. A complete acquittal? What in the world have you done to- I am not the person you will be representing. What? You are currently at the Gatewater Hotel, are you not? And I know that a murder has just taken place there. One Karita was killed and the suspect is mad on guard. You are, as expected, quite on top of things, Mr. Attorney. Now then, what I want is very simple. I want you to attain a complete acquittal for Matt. M Matt on guard? But why? He did not kill anyone. I can attest to that. However... How however However what? However, someone is framing him for the murder. A very smart someone who is setting up to take the fall. What? What? If I agree and do what he wants, can I believe he'll keep his end of the bargain? You are, of course, at a liberty to take me at my word, or not. However, there is one thing you can take as fact. Right now, you are a very precious item is with me in my possession. Oh no! Help! 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 Maya! You have two days. Of course, tonight he will be in questioning with the police. But the trial is in two days. And that trial you will win a not guilty verdict. Remember, you only have one chance. One chance, Mr. Attorney. One? You expect me to not get a guilty in one trial day? Yes, exactly. I don't believe I was wrong in choosing you, so don't let me down. Ugh! Oh, yes, that's right. Now that I'm playing with the role of the kidnapper, I can't pass up this chance to say, and don't even think about calling the cops. Hmm, not a great. Well, not great, but you get the idea. Blast it! Who... Who are you? Very well, I'll tell you that much. My name is... The Killer. <gasps> what? Alright, that's a twist. Mr. Nick! Where is Maya? 
she's been kidnapped, Pearls. No! It's all my fault! If only I'd gone with Mystic Maya! It's not your fault. Uh, Mr. Wright, I, I think we should tell the police what's going on. No, we can't do that. If we do, who knows what'll happen to Maya? Mr. Nick, what about the detective we saw earlier? Detective Gumshoe? Yes, that's it. Wait here, and I'll be right back. All right, I'll take care of the little one for you while you're away. What? Ransom? Shh, not so loud. The ransom is complete acquittal for Matt on guard. Oh, uh, wait. The deal is a complete acquittal in exchange for Maya, you mean? Then this means that Matt on guard is obviously the killer, pal. No doubt about it. But the guy said that he's innocent. You really believe what a kidnapper tells you? Mm. I guess he has a point. If on guard is innocent, then why the kidnapping? And on top of everything else, there's all the evidence we've been finding. Huh? Uh, the forensics team has a field day back there. Um, but it's strange. There's so much evidence that it feels like something's wrong. Yeah. There's too much evidence? Is that even possible? Actually, uh, didn't the kidnapper say something about on guard being set up? Anyway, looks like you won't be leaving here tonight, pal. Uh, just sit tight and cooperate with the investigation. Tomorrow you can start yours. Uh, all right. Isn't there any other way? Oh my gosh. Uh, we've got to be careful about pushing the kidnapper the wrong way. You're right. Wow. wow. Whoa. That's crazy. Oh, my is okay. Date and time, location, who knows? Question mark. Oh, my head! Where am I? I wonder if I'm still in that hotel. What happened to me? Nick! Pearly! Come on, you guys! This isn't funny anymore! Ah, I see that you've awakened. Ah! Who are you? Me? I'm known as The Killer. The Killer? You mean like an assassin? I'm too young to die! Don't worry. You are not my target. For now, anyway. Uh, uh, Nick! Nick! Where are you? Help me! Yes, that's right. Only one person can save you now, and that is Mr. Phoenix Wright. Huh? Wh what Nick! Nick! Nick's gonna save me? Calm down and be a good girl. Think of this as a business transaction. I'm going to contact him now. I hope you'll cooperate and play your assigned role as well. Nick! What's gonna happen to me? Nick! Pearly! Sis! Okay, this is really interesting. Is this Mr. Phoenix Wright, the attorney? You don't need to know who I am. I think you have other things to be concerning yourself with. Such as... March 21st, 8.11 a.m. Right in company law offices. Oh my gosh. Good morning! Ah, morning, Pearls. Mr. Nick! Mr. Nick! Come on! Let's hurry and go see Mr. Accord! We have to wait a bit, Pearls. Visiting hours don't start until 9 a.m., so... Poor Pearl, she's been like this since last night. We managed to get home somehow yesterday evening, thanks to Detective Gumshoe gently holding her by the hand and leading her there. Aww. Aww. But by the looks of it, I don't think Pearl's got any sleep at all last night. Mr. Nick! Mr. Maya, she's alright, right? Yeah, she's alright for now. Either way, I'm gonna save her. You can trust me on that. I'm only able to say this calm and collected because Pearl is doing the crying for both of us right now. Oh my gosh. All right. So it feels. Anyway, guys and gals, that is going to do it for our first episode of Farewell Turnabout. 
Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and we will see you with more Ace Attorney tomorrow at 3 p.m. with the final trial for Justice for All. Well, Until then, check out SAO later today. God bless and happy gaming. <laughs>